What is up? How are you today? Steve here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a super easy lunch that I have nearly every day. So let's get into it. So let me break, break, break it all down for you. Okay, so in this video, we're doing lunch. So what I want to go for today is a macro friendly, high protein lunch option that any of you can have every day. I'm currently cutting at 2250 calories. So I get a good chunk of my macros from lunch and dinner. But I take lunch as an opportunity to take a good chunk of calories in. So this is a great option for that. Wraps, I find are fantastic for getting a, a good chunk of food in in one go it, it's an easy option to just get a load of food in no cooking no microwaving just handy wrap obviously the most important part of making a wrap is wraps so i usually go for fitzgerald wraps from centra you can get them anywhere um, but if you're on a low carb option, they do a kids version, which is, as you can see on the screen, much lower in carbs. I get a good fat source from Flora butter. So that's just a handy, handy fat source to put in the wrap. One of the protein options is ham, obviously a great source of protein and adds to the overall taste. But the main protein comes from Turkey. As you can see, it is a super source of lean protein. I try to have turkey or chicken at least once a day, be it in lunch or dinner, but it is a fantastic source of protein that we should all be eating. It's great. Next up is cheese. You can go for a low fat cheese if you want, but I'm trying to hit a certain fat macro for the day. So I'm just chucking some cheese in here. Great source of fat and solid source of protein. Um, after that, I always throw cashew nuts into everything. Nuts are fantastic for natural fats, carbs, proteins, whatever you're looking for. Nuts will just help you hit your macros for the day. You can throw a handful in here and there, obviously weigh them out, but for wraps, they have a nice crunch and will definitely help you hit your macros for the day. Lastly, I always like to include some form of green shit. Um, go whatever you want, spinach, lettuce, peppers, whatever you want to throw in. Green shit is good. So just before we get into making the wrap, I want to put out a shameless plug to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Thank you. So before I start any meal, I like to do all the weighing out and get everything in order. So put a little cup on, tear it to zero, and I'm gonna start by weighing out the cheese. So I want to put 30 grams of cheese in this wrap. Um, as I said, I'm th trying to hit a fairly high 50 to 60 gram of fat macro. So cheese will help me do that. Um, after that, nice scoop, tear it off again. Same old ding dong. Gonna weigh out some cashew nuts. As I said earlier, great source of natural fats and proteins. So I'm gonna go for 30 grams again. Look at that. Nailed it. Nailed it. 30 grams. Next up is our protein, the turkey. I usually try to get about 80 grams of turkey into these wraps. It's it's a tight fit, but you know, life goes on. Easiest way to do that is weigh the packet full, zero off the scale, then take out as much turkey as you need. In my case, 80 grams, weigh the new packet. And it should be around 80 grams if you've done it right. Obviously, got to clean. Got to clean the countertops, guys. Got to clean them, especially now. Right. Straight in with the wrap. Hit it with a bit of flora butter for that fat we talked about earlier. I uh, usually around 5 grams. I don't really weigh it. You can kind of, you can tell. One swipe of butter will we'll do your 5 grams. On with the turkey. Bit of cheese on top of that. I like to kind of sandwich the cheese in between the turkey and the ham just for that little taste element because you know if i was any good at cooking i would actually cook the meal uh after that for our crunch element our cashew nuts i honestly can't stress enough how good 
nuts are for hitting your macros. Just put them in everything. They're just they're just that last thing. If you're if you're coming up shy on any of your macros, weigh out some nuts. You can hit your target no bother. Lastly, of course, we gotta have our green shit for this wrap. I've gone with lettuce, nice iceberg lettuce crunch. Um, we all know I'm not a fan of veg, but it has to be done. Look at this, absolute techers on the wrap folding. He's only gone and done it. I find this is the easiest way to do it, and then just hold on to it for dear life. Um, if you let go, it will explode. Now there you go, a nice handy lunch wrap. Just looking at the macros for this wrap, as you can see, it is quite high in protein, 50 grams. Um, and as I said, I'm aiming for a high enough 50 to 60 gram fat intake in my own macros. So I'm quite happy with that 30 grams of fat. Uh, as I said at the start, if you want less carbs, go for the kids wrap. If you want a different source of protein, feel free to swap out the meats. This is a fully customizable lunch option that absolutely everyone can do. Guys, if you can't make this wrap, your diet is not the thing you need to be concerned about. It's a good wrap. If you want to see more health, fitness and lifestyle content like this, make sure you smash that subscribe button right now. And I'll see you in the next video. You're going to watch another one? Up there is the rest of the playlist. Down there is what YouTube wants you to watch. Try the wrap. It's good.